They're backing in the boats at Portland's Willamette Park. It's one of the open ramps around and it's busy on a Friday morning. For many of these folks, it's all about the fishing. We're uh, salmon fishing. We uh, have fished for the last four days and got one each day. From Fly 8, you could see the coordinated moves of trucks and trailers pulling in and out of the boat ramps. The ramps and docks are where social distancing can be tough to achieve. Dave Scherer sees most people behaving. I think they're keeping their distance pretty well. There's always a handful of offenders, but for the most part, I think they've done a pretty doggone good job. But the social distancing concern is real. So Washington State went all in, suspending the fishing season for now, and state-controlled boat ramps are closed. Fishing's on in Oregon, but state parks are shut down, closing ramps and water access too. And many cities and counties have closed their boat ramps for now. Back at Willamette Park. We're trying to get every day we can get in fishing and, and before they close the ramps, hopefully the ramps won't get closed. People are willing to risk getting too close on shore to enjoy the wide open water. Well, that's why we're out here, because we're at least six feet away from everybody. We've been keeping our distance in the boat, and uh, you know what? There's On this water, we're, we're sometimes many, many, many yards away from any other people. The payoff was great for Dave Scherer a few days ago. First day uh, on the water on Tuesday, first 10 minutes, hook this fish. 15 minutes later, we're headed in the boat. An 18 pound Spring Chinook keeper. And others find other payoffs on the water. It's been uh, great seeing people out in their boats with their family and it's a good recreational thing to do. So this is a big deal that Washington State is shutting down fishing until at least May 4th. But before those of us in Washington State go down to Oregon to try and fish, you should know Oregon's banning non-resident fishing starting at midnight tonight. And that goes for shell fishing and hunting too. In Vancouver, Tim Gordon, KGW News.